Marshall Universe Preview Note before watching, the video contains spoilers. Please like and subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to never miss new video updates. Season 8, Episodes 12, Lindong Revealing All Trump Cards The man stood arrogantly in the sky with one hand behind his back, while he looked down upon everyone on the mountaintop. On his face, hung a smile that seemed to be a smile yet was not. The entire mountaintop was rather quiet. Everyone's expressions were quite grim. Some tightly clenched their fist, wanting to cry out furiously. However, a basin of cold water seemed to have been poured on their heads when they saw the sorry state of Chin Tian as he lay on the ground, even Chin Tian, who had stepped into the 6 Yuan Nirvana stage, had been so miserably defeated. It would likely be completely pointless even if they stepped forward. Lan Ying and the other Nirvana Golden Ranking experts wore gloomy and fluctuating expressions. They had clearly been shaken by that man's previous attack. How is he this powerful? Lin Dong could not help but frown while he stared at this scene before softly asking. It is because of that heaven ceiling array. Little Martin replied faintly. It should be a pure Yuan treasure and this person can clearly utilize some of the array's power. Although this tiny bit of power is practically a fraction of the array's power, it is not surprising for him to defeat Chin Tian in a single strike if we factor in his actual strength. Pure Yuan treasure? Lin Dong's eyebrows slightly knitted together. A treasure that is even stronger than a heavenly soul treasure. That kind of thing is quite rare even within the super sex. Little Martin explained. A pure Yuan treasure is extremely powerful. Moreover, the strength that it possessed far exceeds your imagination. This heavenly ceiling array should be a type of high grade pure Yuan array. Otherwise, it would be unable to lock this entire space. Powerful. Lin Dong quietly clicked his tongue. Using one treasure to seal an entire space. Just what kind of ability was that? Compared with the so-called pure Yuan treasure, the Black Dragon Sky Roaring Seal in his hand really felt a little weak and insignificant. In that case is the mysterious stone talisman also considered a pure Yuan treasure? Lin Dong mused for a moment before he suddenly asked curiously. DCH, this thing is something that I am unable to fully grasp even after so many years. How could a pure Yuan treasure compared with its level of secrecy? Little Martin curled his mouth and appeared to feel quite disdained. So even you did not completely figure out the properties of the mysterious stone talisman. Lin Dong rolled his eyes at Little Martin and said. Little Martin was immediately stunned upon hearing this. It seemed that his pride took a hit. He wanted to refute it but discovered that he seemed to be really uncertain about just what use this mysterious stone talisman did. Hence, he could only rub his nose bitterly. This situation does not appear to be too good. Little Martin changed the topic as he looked at the sky and said. Lin Dong sighed softly and nodded. Clearly, he did not expect that this Hundred Empire War would actually end up turning into this state. His father, grandfather and the others were awaiting for him to deliver the good news back. If they end up hearing that he was being captured by the Western Xuan region, it was likely that they would not be able to take it. Let's observe the situation. That man called Kao Yu in the sky looked at the silence on the mountaintop and smiled faintly. With a wave of his hand, the black light balls in the hands of the many figures behind him emitted even more rays of light. These light rays penetrated through the space and vaguely appeared to have formed an enormous black light formation in the sky above. We cannot allow them to complete the formation. Watching the formation that was gradually being formed in the sky, Lan Ying, Qing Feng and the others also had increasingly ugly faces. They were aware that once the formation was completed, this realm would be transferred to the western Xuan region. Their situation would really become extremely miserable then. After all, the relationship between the Western Xuan region and the Eastern Xuan region was quite hostile. Let's fight. I do not wish to head to that terrible Western Xuan region. A man with a black heavy sword on his back spoke with a gloomy expression. He was someone from the Sword Empire and possessed quite a great strength. With the strength of Kao Yu. Who can fight with him? Lan Ying clenched her hand tightly. If they failed to stop Kao Yu, it was likely that they would be unable to stop the other party from establishing the formation. However, even if the experts from the Nirvana Golden Ranking swarmed towards Kao Yu, it was likely that the rest would have difficulty interrupting the other party. The genius experts from the other 10 super empires had sunken expressions upon hearing Lan Ying's words. Even Qin Tian, who had stepped into the 6 Yuan Nirvana stage, was defeated by Qin Tian with one strike. Who amongst them dared to fight with this Kao Ying in a one-on-one -on -one battle? I will do it. The rest of you should lead the others and disrupt the formation. The man carrying a heavy sword clenched his teeth violently and stepped out. He beckoned with his hand and the heavy sword on his back flew out immediately. A sharp sword glow erupted. Chen Nan, you. 
Lan Ying and the others were startled upon seeing this scene. Before their words sounded, however, that man had already rushed out explosively. The sword and his body became one as they transformed into a bright glow that tore through the distant sky and pierced towards Cao Yu in a lightning-like man. Stubborn fool. Cao Yu's expression was indifferent as he watched the figure that had rushed over after transforming into a sharp sword. A cold snort sounded and a large hand was immediately extended. Bang! After his hand was extended, the space in front had once again erupted into a monstrous black light. Immediately, it transformed into a black light large hand that violently slammed onto the sword glow. Bang! The sharp sword glow basically collapsed almost instantly under that black light large hand. That figure within it also spat out a mouthful of fresh blood and shot backwards miserably. This expert from the Sword Empire had clearly been defeated by this Kaiyu with just one strike. Chen Nan. Lan Ying and the others hurriedly rushed to Chen Nan's side. He looked at that miserable manner manner of the latter and a fury surged within his eyes. He was clearly extremely agitated. Cough, this fellow is really strong. Chen Nan spat out a mouthful of fresh blood as he spoke with an unwilling hoarse voice. Damn it, we'll all fight. An expert cried out furiously. Everyone around had faces that were filled with fury. They were unable to swallow the anger of having been stepped on the head by these fellows from the Western Xuan region. Compared to being captured to the Western Xuan region, we might as well fight to the death with them here. Another expert also clenched his teeth and said. That's right, we'll battle it out with them. Lan Ying also bit her red lips with the back of her teeth when she heard the various furious cries that sounded from all around. Her pretty face became slightly icy cold as he stood up. Ching Fang, Ma Lin. Mu say, we'll attack together and hold back Kao Yu. The others should all attack and destroy the formation. Understood. That Nirvana golden ranking expert beside Lan Ying, whose name was called, also nodded heavily. Killing intent surged within his eyes. Ki. Lan Ying also did things in a decisive fashion. Moreover, she was aware that they could not afford to delay any longer. Immediately, her body moved and she rushed out. However, a hand was suddenly extended from behind her just as she was about to step forward. After which, it was pressed onto her soft shoulder. All of you are no match for him. Don't go. Lan Ling turned her head and looked at Lin Dong with a helpless face. The back of her teeth bit her red lips and she coldly laughed, I thought you will continue to hide behind me. From the looks of this, she was clearly brooding over the fact that Lin Dong only chose to step up at this moment. I am not a heavyweight character unlike you Super Empire members. Why are you placing so much hope on me? Lin Dong smiled faintly but was unconcerned. He merely raised his head and stared at Kaoyu. After a short silence, he sighed, forget it. Leave him to me. You? Kao Ying and the others were startled upon hearing this. Although their hearts were gripped when watching Lin Dong and Lin Langshan exchange blows, Kao Yu was someone who could even defeat Chan Tian with just one strike. Why? You don't allow me to hide for a little. Are you also not allowing me to fight now that I want to? Lin Dong stared intently at Lan Ying and involuntarily spoke in a helpless manner. Lan Ying's pretty face immediately became red upon hearing this. She lost the sharp wit that she had from before. Instead, she spoke hesitantly, that fellow is very strong. There's no choice. I, too, do not wish to head to that whatever Western Chuan region. He shrugged his shoulders in a somewhat free and easy manner and laughed, moreover, regardless of how strong he is, we must at least give it a try, right? Lin Dong ceased saying anything upon saying these words. He slowly stepped forward. However, he did not even take two steps forward when he saw Little Martin appearing in front of him in a ghost-like manner. Leave it to me. Little Martin stared at Lin Dong and said. He clearly understood Lin Dong. Although the latter was quite powerful, it would be a little difficult for him to defeat Kao Yu. There is the presence of Yuan Gate here. Those fellows do not appear to be magnanimous. You cannot reveal your identity. Lin Dong shook his head slightly and used a soft voice that only Little Martin could hear. You are no match for him. Little Martin frowned and replied. A strange smile surfaced on Lin Dong's face when he heard this. He gently patted Little Martin's shoulder and softly said, that may not be certain. Don't you want to know why I have been suppressing my mental power? Next, I will show you why. Little Martin's eyes slowly narrowed as Lin Dong rushed by him. Could this fellow really do it? On the mountaintop. Numerous gazes were focused on the young man who was slowly stepping forward. Their gazes contained a rather peculiar expression. Lin Dong had already proven his extraordinary strength time and time again in the earlier battles. Although he only appeared to be at the 4 Yuan Nirvana stage on the surface, everyone clearly understood that his battle capabilities exceeded that level. From the way they saw it, 
Lin Dong already possessed the qualifications to be compared with Qin Tian. However, in this current situation, even Qin Tian had been utterly defeated. Could Lin Dong really turn the tides? Lin Dong? From the skies above, Cao Yu lowered his head and stared at Lin Dong. The corners of his mouth lifted to form a strange arc as he softly laughed, I have watched your earlier battle. You're not bad but you are still not my match. I would advise against trying to show off. Lin Dong smiled and replied, who knows unless I give it a try. Don't you agree? I'm afraid that you will not even be able to preserve that pathetic life of yours if you try. Cao Yu laughed. Big brother Cao, why are you wasting your breath on this brat? A mere for you on Nirvana stage actually dares to act mighty. Why not leave him to me? The feminine man beside Cao Yu looked at Lin Dong in a strange manner as he released a queer laughter. I will handle it. Cao Yu waved his hand. His eyes paused on Lin Dong as he spoke, this person is not as simple as he appears. Underestimating him would cause you dearly. Oh? The man known as Chang Wei raised his eyebrows. He was clearly unagreeable with these words. Though he was not one of the top practitioners within the younger generation of the Western Chuan region, Lin Dong and the others had yet to even enter the super sex, while he on the other hand had already trained in the super sect for two years. Pay attention to the others while establishing the formation. Cao Yu faintly commanded before slowly stepping forward. He extended his hand towards Lin Dong, curling it slightly as he laughed, do it. Allow me to see just how many rounds you can last against me. I will leave the matter of disrupting the formation to you guys. Lin Dong turned around and spoke to Lan Ying and the rest. Be careful. Lan Ying spoke with worry. If Lin Dong was also finished off by Cao Yu, it would be far too great a blow on their morale. Lin Dong smiled a little and nodded. Soon after, he exhaled deeply. A sharp glint gradually surged deep within his eyes. Imitating Cao Yu, he also curled his hand. Go ahead. Allow me to have a taste of just how powerful you experts from the Western Chuan region are. Cao Yu was clearly a little irritated by Lin Dong's stance. His eyes immediately narrowed as a cold glint flashed past them. Truly an arrogant fool. Cao Yu inwardly sneered. Without further ado, he extended his hand as his finger pressed onto the empty space. Bang! This seemingly casual action caused the Yuan power of the land to boil in an instant. The empty space once again became distorted as a monstrous black light surged out. It directly transformed into a ray of black light that possessed an incomparably sharp aura as it tore through the sky and shot towards Lin Dong in a fashion that could not be dodged. Lan Ying and the others were alarmed when they saw Cao Yu's ferocious attack. From the looks of it, Cao Yu had no intentions of allowing Lin Dong to last for even a single round. An attack at this speed was impossible to dodge. It was just as Lan Ying and the others had expected. Faced with this space-tearing black ray of light, Lin Dong did not plan to dodge at all. Swoosh! The black ray of light that contained a shocking lethal force had arrived in front of Lin Dong in the next moment. The hearts of the Lan Yin group sunk immediately when they saw this scene. Bang! A low and deep sound suddenly echoed out, as Lan Ying and the rest's expressions dimmed. Was it over? Fool who seeks death! Chang Wei and the others involuntarily laughed out loud and spoke in a strange voice upon seeing this scene. He is not dead. Cao Yu's eyebrows slowly knitted together. His soft voice contained a trace of surprise. What? The heartily laughing Chang Wei and Gang were immediately stunned when they heard Cao Yu's words, while astonishment covered their faces. They clearly understood just how terrifying the heaven ceiling ray was when activated by Cao Yu. How could Lin Dong possibly withstand such power? Cao Yu ignored them. His eyes were tightly fixed onto the spot where the black light was gradually scattering. An exceptionally sturdy figure was faintly visible there. Huh? That's not right. Chang Wei's and Lan Ying's group were stunned when they saw the exceptionally sturdy figure. The black light finally completely dispersed as the strong figure finally appeared in everyone's sights. Its body was bright red. At a glance, it was as though it had been constructed from red copper. That face was also not that of Lin Dong. Instead, an unfamiliar face flickered with a red glow. This is... a blood soul puppet? Cao Yu's pupils slightly shrunk as he stared at the bright red body. A faint yet baleful aura spread out from the body. He slowly opened his mouth, surprised that Lin Dong not only possessed a soul puppet, but it was even the strongest blood soul puppet. Most importantly, the level of this blood soul puppet was quite high. It had likely reached the grade 5 level or higher. Cluck. A human figure slowly walked out from behind that sturdy soul puppet. He raised his head and smiled at Cao Yu, your eyesight is quite good. This soul puppet was naturally the blood soul puppet in Lin Dong's hands. Ever since he had auctioned for that desolate heavenly cow skeleton in the Wangshang city, 
Little Martin had used this set of bones to strengthen the Blood Soul puppet. Combined with Lindong's enormous stash of Nirvana pills, the current Blood Soul puppet was many times stronger than before. Based on Lin Dong's guess, the current Blood Soul Puppet should have reached the Grade 5 Soul Puppet level. Its defensive strength had become a little terrifying due to the addition of the Desolate Heavenly Cow to refine it. Cao Yu's ferocious attack was able to seriously injure a 5 Yuan Nirvana stage expert. However, it merely left a shallow mark on the Blood Soul Puppet's body. Lin Dong. Joy surfaced in the Lan Ying and the rest sighs when they saw that Lin Dong was fine. Clearly, they never imagined that Lin Dong would actually use the Soul Puppet to block Cao Yu's attack. A strong Blood Soul Puppet. However, I wonder how many of my attacks it can withstand? Cao Yu smiled in an indifferent manner. Won't you know once you try? Lin Dong grinned. Immediately, a sharpness flashed in his eyes. His foot stomped onto the ground as his body rushed out. His hand clenched around the heavenly crocodile bone spear that appeared. With a jerk. The spear transformed into numerous sharp spear glows that filled the sky, enveloping Cao Yu. Some faint green light also quietly flowed while the spear glows gathered. Swoosh. Cao Yu's eyes hardened a little when he saw Lin Dong attacking. He struck his palm forward as black light immediately gathered in the sky. Space wiggled as the black light transformed into an enormous hand that violently slapped at Lin Dong. Bang. However, just as the black light giant hand was about to strike Lin Dong, a crimson glow suddenly arrived. With a punch, it collided head-on with the giant black light hand. Swoosh swoosh. A shocking ripple erupted above the Lin Dong's head. However, the latter completely ignored it. His body moved and appeared in front of Cao Yu. Sharp spear gloves were aimed at all the Cao Yu's vital points. Humphrey. Upon seeing Lin Dong's crafty usage of the Blood Soul Puppet to block the attack, while he unleashed an attack of his own, Cao Yu involuntarily let out a cold snort. Bright golden light surged out immediately, directly transforming into a golden shield with golden light seemingly flowing on it. Clang clang clang. Sharp spear glows viciously struck the golden shield. However, it merely caused some sparks to appear, and was clearly unable to break the latter's defense. Is this all you've got? Cao Ying sneered. However, his sneer had only just formed when his eyes suddenly hardened. He had realized that the spear glows did not immediately disappear after being blasted apart. Instead, numerous green lights rushed out from within them. These green lights seemed to be green scales. The scales flashed as a faint but extremely sharp ripple spread out from them. Chi 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 chi. The green scales were like rain. They arrived quickly and ruthlessly struck the gold shield. This time around, there were no sparks. The green scales pierced through the incomparably hard golden shield, before zipping towards Kaiyu's vital spots at an astonishing speed. This is the real attack huh? This sudden scene also caused Kaiyu to be startled. Lin Dong's earlier attack was merely a ruse. The true attack was these scales hidden within the spear glows. There is some ingenuity but it is useless against me. Cao Yu's eyes turned cold. His body shook slightly as the surrounding space became distorted. Black light spread out from these distorted areas, forming a light circle that covered his body. Clang clang. The incomparably sharp green scales ruthlessly struck the light barrier. However, they appeared to be just like stones sinking into the ocean. They did not cause any damage as they completely disappeared. Lin Dong, this realm has already been covered by the Heaven Sealing Array. I can borrow some of its strength. Forget about you. Even if all of you were to attack, you will not be able to do anything to me. Cao Yu stood within the light circle as he sneered. Swoosh. However, Lin Dong completely ignored the Cao Yu. He pressed down with the tips of his feet as his body shot into the sky. He seated himself cross-legged in the sky amidst numerous stunned eyes, while wave after wave of powerful mental energy suddenly swept out from his Naiwan palace. Mental power was just like a storm that was unfurling. Moreover, it spread at a terrifying speed. It was as though a volcano that had been suppressed for countless number of years had finally erupted. Rumble. Dark clouds suddenly gathered in the sky while Lin Dong's mental energy wildly erupted and mad wind raged all around. This scene stunned everyone. A moment later, they inhaled violently. Is that the wind lightning trial? What is that fellow planning? Boom. Majestic mental energy swept out in the sky like a hurricane. Immediately, violent gusts of wind howled over the land unceasingly, creating a dreadful sight. As mental energy continued to surge, storm clouds frantically began to gather in the sky. Meanwhile, lightning swam through the storm clouds like a snake as thunder rumbled violently across the area. Everyone watched this scene in shock. Of course, they were not shocked by the wind lightning trial. After all, 
Everyone here was fairly skilled and there were even some of them who specialized in mental energy and could not be more familiar with the wind lightning trial. As such, instead of being shocked by the wind lightning trial, they were shocked by Lin Dong's actions. The wind lightning trial and Nirvana tribulation together. Even a symbol master would search for a peaceful place to undergo a trial. However, Lin Dong had chosen to activate the trial while he was facing a terrifying opponent like Kao Yu. This move truly befuddled everyone here. Is that fellow planning to use the same trick again? Lan Ying and the rest were startled, before anxiety rapidly emerged in their eyes. Kao Yu was not Song Zhen. Furthermore, Lin Dong was only able to pull it off previously because he used it in an unconventional manner. At that time, no one had realized that he was secretly undergoing Nirvana tribulation. However, the current situation was different. Not only was Kao Yu far stronger than Song Zhen, the wind lightning trial also caused a huge disturbance. Therefore, any fool would know what he was up to. Did he really think Kao Yu was dumb enough to forsake such an opportunity? Beside them, Liu Bei, Mo Leng, Su Kui and the rest exchanged looks with each other when they saw Lin Dong's actions. There were traces of worry in their eyes. Big brother Lin Diao, isn't this too risky? Su Ru's tiny face was filled with worry. After hesitating for a moment, she was finally unable to resist any further as she turned around and asked Little Martin. Little Martin narrowed his eyes as he stared right at Lin Dong's seated figure. He could not fathom the meaning behind Lin Dong's actions as well. Summoning the wind lightning trial a truly suicidal move. He is not an idiot. He must have his reasons for doing so. Let's continue to observe. There is no point in speculating at this point. Little Martin could only say these words at this point in time. When they heard his words, Liu Bei and the rest laughed bitterly before they lowered their heads and sighed. Regardless, it was too late for them to worry. All they could do now was to believe in Lin Dong. He he, a truly bold kid. He actually dares to summon the wind lightning trial at such a time. In the sky, the elite practitioners from the West Xuan region stared peculiarly at Lin Dong as they commented. Big brother Cao, looks like he is deliberately provoking you. Chang Wei released a weird laugh. Suddenly summoning the wind lightning trial during a fight with Cao Yu. If this was not considered as a form of provocation, what else could it be? Cao Yu's face was calm while his gaze was fixed onto Lin Dong. Even though he was slightly perplexed by the latter's actions, he did not plan to stop. Instead, he slowly lifted his palm before he calmly said, I do not know what you plan on doing. However, since you want to die, don't blame me. Boom. As Cao Yu suddenly closed his palm, a terrifying shockwave suddenly erupted from within it. The surrounding space distorted, before a black glow gushed out, transforming into a nearly 10 feet long black spear. Meanwhile, a peculiar symbol faintly hovered on the tip of the black spear. Swoosh. Cao Yu did not hesitate at all. His eyes turned cold as the black spear instantly shot forward. Tearing through the air, it carried a terrifying shockwave that was powerful enough to destroy a 5 Yuan Nirvana stage expert as it shot towards Lin Dong like lightning. As they watched Cao Yu's killing move, everyone's hearts rose. The black spear was extremely swift and it appeared before Lin Dong in a flash. However, just as that black spear was about to release its destructive power, a blood red figure appeared like a phantom and suddenly jabbed out with its copper red fist. It was the blood soul pup. Boom. An astonishing force unfurled in mid-air. Even though the blood soul puppet was able to block the black spear, its body was also thrown backwards. In fact, one could even see a deep scar on its copper red fist. Evidently, even with its powerful defenses, the blood soul puppet was still wounded by Kao Yu's attack. Fortunately, the blood soul puppet was unable to feel anything. Therefore, it would battle until it was completely destroyed. Lin Dong calmly observed this. However, his eyes remained as still as unmoving water. In fact, he did not even show any indications of getting up. Instead, he cupped his hands together and his hand seals changed. Boom! As his hand seals changed, his majestic mental energy surged once again. At the same time, the thunderous roars caused by the storm clouds grew increasingly terrifying. The wind lightning trial has become stronger. The sudden change in the wind lightning trial was immediately detected by the crowd. Immediately, all of them exclaimed in shock while the doubt in their eyes grew. Evidently, they did not understand why Lin Dong had chosen to release more mental energy to stimulate the wind lightning trial, instead of trying to restrain its power. The strength of this wind lightning trial has already surpassed the second stage. There were some experts here who specialized in mental energy. When they saw the undulations from the storm clouds, they were able to sense which stage the trial belonged to. Humphrey. A vicious expression faintly flashed across Kao Yu's face. 
It was clear that he was secretly worried about Lin Dong's peculiar actions deep within his heart. Immediately, he ferociously took a step forward and flicked all ten of his fingers. The black glow in the horizon trembled, seemingly filling the sky as it formed into countless black light pillars which rained down onto Lin Dong. As the light pillars swept forth, the blood soul puppet's sturdy figure once again appeared in front of Lin Dong. A resplendent blood red glow erupted from within its body as it protected Lin Dong like a glowing shield. Watch me smash your blood soul puppet to pieces. Cao Yu was similarly frustrated by the blood soul puppet. Immediately, a cold glint flashed across his eyes as the black light pillars instantly howled forth and rammed into the blood soul puppet. Thump thump thump. A terrifying shock wave immediately erupted on the blood soul puppet's body, while waves of berserk energy frantically unfurled. As the black light swiftly disappeared, the blood soul puppet's body appeared once again. However, this time around, there were several startling wounds on its body. Several cracks began to spread across its body, while its blood red glow had significantly dimmed. Evidently, even with its powerful defenses, it was no longer able to remain completely unharmed after taking so many attacks from Cao Yu head on. At this rate, Lin Dong's blood soul puppet will not last for long. Lin Ying and the rest wore grim expressions as they gazed upon the state of Lin Dong's blood soul puppet, while their fists involuntarily tightened. Judging from the current situation, it seemed like Lin Dong wanted to use his blood soul puppet to buy him some time. Could the blood soul puppet really buy him enough time to undergo the wind lightning trial? Rumble. While Lan Ying and the rest were anxiously worrying in their hearts, the storm clouds in the sky started to churn even more violently. Meanwhile, the shock waves contained within grew increasingly terrifying. The wind lightning trials are stacking? While the commotion within the storm clouds grew increasingly terrifying, a shocked cry suddenly erupted on the mountaintop. An expert who specialized in mental energy cultivation stared in shock at the sky. His expression was as though he had seen a ghost. Stacking the wind lightning trials? When they heard his words, Lan Ying and the rest's hearts skipped a beat. What did he mean? Could it be that Lin Dong did not only summon one wind lightning trial? Was he instead stacking them together? When their thoughts reached such a point, their expressions turned extremely interesting. Stacking them together was not as simple as adding them together. The wind lighting trial has reached the third stage. He plans to undergo both the second and third stage together. On top of the mountain, another person shrieked. That's not right, the wind lightning trial is still becoming stronger. My god, this lunatic. Does he plan to stack three trials together? Not even a six seal symbol master can handle that. A series of shocked exclamations continuously sounded out on the mountain top. Furthermore, each time a voice sounded out, Lan Ying and the rest's heart would violently twitch. Stacking three trials together? Such a power could probably squash a six Yuan Nirvana stage expert to pulp. What was Lin Dong planning to do? Rumble. In the sky, the storm clouds manically churned. Meanwhile, the lightning snake coursing through the clouds grew from its initial thickness of an arm to its current several feet look width. From a distance away, it looked as if a mini lightning dragon was flying within the cloud. Little Martin lifted his head, a strange look in his eyes as he stared at this sight. Following which, he turned to look at Lin Dong, who was seated below the storm clouds as a flash of inspiration flashed across his eyes. Is he planning to borrow the strength of the wind lightning trial? What a lunatic! Rumble! Thunder boomed across the sky in an astonishing manner as the storm clouds closed in. The thunderbolts flashing within the clouds made it look as though apocalypse was approaching. The storm clouds had spread till they covered a hundred feet radius, while a berserk power seemed to simmer within it. Even the powerful five Yuan Nirvana stage individuals, were now deathly pale. They could sense a true power of destruction from within the clouds. All of them clearly understood that any defense of theirs would be futile in the face of these storm clouds. Stacking Trials. Everyone had now figured out Lin Dong's intentions. He was actually planning on enduring three wind lightning trials at the same time. Lunatic. Everyone spat out this word in their hearts in response to Lin Dong's crazy move. They knew that no one with any semblance of normality would dare to perform such a feat. Of course, an ordinary person would not even have the chance to perform such an act. The amount of metal energy required to summon three wind lightning trials simultaneously was frightening. What this meant was that the mental energy of the individual summoning the trials must be continuously and firmly suppressed. Moreover, no mental energy can leak out midway. This must continue until it was sufficient to summon three wind lightning trials, before allowing everything to completely erupt. If Lin Dong was able to endure these three stacked wind lightning trials, Lin Dong's metal energy would rapidly soar until it reached the four seal heaven symbol master level. Of course, if he failed, 
he would immediately be blasted by this incomparably violent wind lightning trial until nothing remained. The destructive force that eventually erupted from the stacking of three trials was far from what that of three separate trials could compare with. Is his head broken or something? The experts from the Western Chuen region also watched the thunderclouds spreading across the sky with strange expressions on their faces. The terrifying fluctuation emitted by the storm clouds caused their hearts to jump in fear. They were truly unable to comprehend just what Lin Dong was attempting to do. With the appearance of these storm clouds, there was perhaps now no need for anyone to attack him as once the lightning struck, even ashes would not remain. Just what is he trying to do? Chang Wei also frowned deeply. He wanted to laugh and mock Lin Dong, but there was now an unfathomable pressure in his heart. He was no fool after all and Lin Dong's actions were really a little too strange. As the saying went, there was definitely some strange reason behind any abnormality. Lin Dong definitely had his reasons for doing so. However, that final aim of his was temporarily unknown to all of them. Big Brother Cao. Chang Wei's eyes looked towards Cao Yu at the front, catching sight of Cao Yu's somewhat dark face. He could tell that the latter was feeling a little uneasy. Was it because of this fellow before them? The frown on Chang Wei brows deepened. His heart felt constricted from holding his breath. Clearly, he did not expect that they would be so affected by a brat who was only at 4 Yuan Nirvana stage. Big Brother Cao, shall we watch and wait for the time being? The storm clouds are too terrifying. That brat will definitely be unable to receive the trial with his strength. If we attack hastily, we might end up being tricked. He might be attempting to use some kind of tactic to goad us into attacking, making us help him resist the wind lightning trial while he gains from it. Chang Wei's eyes flickered before he spoke in a low voice. Cao Yu's eyes were narrowed. His gaze was firmly fixed on the figure seated below the storm clouds. Currently, Lin Dong had already shut his eyes, appearing as though he was making preparations to endure the trial. Cao Yu's eyes were dark and solemn. What Chang Wei said was indeed quite a wise plan. As the saying goes, dealing with the ever-changing by not adopting any change and quietly wait for Lin Dong's subsequent move. However, why was it that he felt a faint unease? We cannot wait any longer. Cao Yu's eyes flashed as they suddenly hardened. He was a decisive person, hence once he made up his mind, he would not hesitate at all. Immediately, he took a step forward and his hand began to form seals at lightning speed. Heaven Sealing Array, Heaven Locking Symbol. A deep cry suddenly exploded from Cao Yu's mouth. After which, a shocking ripple spread out from within his body. The entire space swiftly became distorted, and in the next instant, numerous crack lines started to emerge as enormous black light chains shot out explosively through the cracks. Crash. Black light chains rushed out in a flash. They swiftly crossed each other in the sky, swiftly transforming into a black symbol. Swoosh. The enormous black symbol rushed out, immediately enveloping Lin Dong from all directions, while a terrifying aura swiftly unfurled. Lin Dong's tightly shut eyes slowly opened when this enormous black symbol rushed over. Immediately, the corners of his mouth quietly lifted into a slight arc. Is it finally here? The enormous black symbol swiftly flew into the territory of the thunder clouds under the watching eyes of the crowd. However, when this symbol was within a 10 feet radius of Lin Dong, the billowing storm clouds in the sky suddenly shuddered. A split second later, silver lightning lit up the entire place. A loud rumbling sound accompanied countless large lightning pillars as they frantically poured down. Rumble. Thunderbolts rained downwards. Countless thunderbolts exploded on the enormous black symbol as wave after wave of indescribably wild and violent ripples spread outwards, forcibly striking the black symbol as it swiftly dimmed. The frightening might of the three stack trials had finally been displayed at this moment. Crack. The black symbol grew increasingly dim. Finally, numerous cracks appeared spreading until the symbol burst apart with a loud bang. Humphrey. Cao Yu's body jerked back when the black symbol was blasted apart as a moan was emitted from his mouth. He had clearly suffered some backlash. Immediately, his face became incomparably dark and solemn. To actually summon three stacking trials. What a brilliant tactic. However, aren't you afraid that you will not be able to deal with this monstrous thing that you have summoned? Cao Yu's expression was dark and twisted as he cried out. I do not need to deal with this wind lightning trial because it will be used to finish you off. Lin Dong looked at Cao Yu's twisted face. A strange smile appeared on the former's face as he softly replied. What shameless boasting. Cao Yu's pupils shrunk slightly, however, a sneer formed on his mouth. He did not believe that the storm clouds would attack him if he did not launch an attack. Currently, the one who was about to face the trial was Lin Dong and not him. The strange smile at the corners of Lin Dong's mouth grew wider. 
He immediately raised his head and looked at the storm clouds that now spanned several hundred feet as both of his hands slowly spread apart. Immediately, waves of black light surged out, transforming into a gigantic black hole above his head. A unique power suddenly unfurled from the black hole. Suddenly, the thundercloud in the sky shrunk. In the next instant, the thundercloud shook violently and countless enormous thunderbolts once again descended. This time around, their target was Lindong. Devour. The monstrous lightning appeared as a strange glint as they were reflected in Lindong's eyes, while he spread his hands and softly muttered. Boom. The enormous black hole above his head suddenly began to rotate rapidly as waves of pulling force erupted. The lightning that originally rushed towards Lindong suddenly changed direction at this moment and charged into the enormous black hole. Rumble. Countless thunderbolts poured into the black hole, however, it did not cause any explosion. Only a loud rumble was emitted. Meanwhile, below the black hole, Lindong was completely unharmed. Everyone was astonished when they saw this sight. No one had expected that Lindong was actually able to receive the terrifying wind lightning trial. Big Brother Cow, the situation is not quite right. We should call Big Brother Motong and the rest guarding outside this space. Chang Wei cried out in a low voice, his expression drastically changing as watch this mysterious scene. Cao Yu's face was dark. His eyes were glued onto Lin Dong, who remained perfectly fine in the face of the sky full of thunderbolts, while the unease within his heart grew increasingly greater. After pondering for a moment, he finally nodded his head. Chang Wei hurriedly took out a light ball from his Kuan Kun bag after seeing Cao Yu nod, before quickly shattering it. Immediately, a golden light rushed out, burrowing into the space around it before disappearing. Shitty brat, once big brother Motong's group enters, only death will await you even if you really manage to endure the three trails. A fierce glint flashed across Chang Wei's eyes as he watched the golden light disappear. This was a black spatial region outside the ancient battlefield realm. It was possible to enter the eastern Xuan region if one broke out from this place. At this moment, ten figures quietly sat within this darkness. Their bodies released an extremely astonishing ripple, a ripple that far exceeded that of Lin Dong or even Cao Yu's group. Swoosh. A golden light suddenly rushed into the darkness. After which, a human figure grabbed it. Big Brother Motong. It seems that Cao Yu and the others have met with some trouble. The eyes of the person who had received the golden light flickered as he raised his head and looked towards the front. A skinny figure was seated at that spot. On his lap was a large black blade. Oh? The shut eyes of the figure gradually opened. He frowned a little and said, we need to guard this place just in case. He paused after his words sounded out before shaking his head and continuing, never mind, I will go. The rest of you will remain here. While he spoke, he slowly stood up. However, just as he was about to move, his pupils suddenly shrunk. He turned his head, only to see a ray of light suddenly appear within the darkness as a sharp aura seemed to tear open this space. At the edge of where the light had torn the space apart, a dozen figures rushed in. A graceful figure led them, while a clear and elegant laughter faintly echoed from a distance. Ha! Motong, you have traveled a great distance from the western Xuan region to this place. Our eastern Xuan region should at least perform our duty as the host right? The expression of the man, who carried a black blade, slowly turned grave at this moment. His eyes contained a fear that could not be hidden as he stared at the figure at the very front. Ling Quangju. I did not expect that even you would be dispatched. Bang bang. Thunderbolt raged between the sky and land. Countless lightning pillars wildly poured from the storm clouds, before they smashed towards the figure under it from every direction. However, each time these lightning pillars were about to touch that figure, it would be dragged into the enormous black hole that was rotating rapidly above. Finally, it would transform into a rumbling muffled sound that was emitted from the black hole. Lin Dong has actually received all those thunderbolts. All the gazes on the mountaintop contained a rich shock as they watched this scene. They were really unable to believe that Lin Dong had actually blocked the wind lightning trial, that even a 6 Yuan Nirvana stage expert would be afraid of. How is this possible? Lu Bei and the rest muttered to themselves. However, a dense joy surged into their eyes soon after. Lin Dong had once again shown them what was called a miracle. That strength from the black hole appears to be the swallowing strength of Toti sect. Could it be that Lin Dong had really completely snatched the strength of Doty from Song Zhen when they fought previously? It seems so. What a frightening fellow. Little Martin heard many private conversations from all around him. A strange expression also flashed across his eyes as he watched Lin Dong in the sky. He laughed softly, this fellow is really unpredictable. With Little Martin's understanding of Lin Dong, he was naturally aware that the black hole was not the so-called Toti strength. Instead, 
It was the true devouring power. However, in order to avoid exposing the devouring ancestral symbol, Lin Dong had purposefully used the toady strength to act as a cover. Moreover, little Martin was even able to feel a kind of familiar ripple from deep within that black hole. It was that of the mysterious stone talisman. Clearly, Lin Dong had borrowed the strength of the two great mysterious objects, the devouring ancestral symbol and the mysterious stone talisman, in order to receive the frightening lightning bolts. Otherwise, he was truly unqualified to do so. Borrowing the combined strength of three wind lightning tribulation and using it as his own ha. Huh? Little Martin curled his mouth slightly. His heart released a soft praise. At this moment, even he could not help but feel amazed by Lin Dong's plan. This fellow was indeed extremely cautious. He had actually hit a final move that even he was unaware of. Little Martin clearly knew that Lin Dong had definitely kept this tactic since a very long time ago in preparation for an emergency. This fellow always loved to keep a trump card that caused one to be incomparably shocked. These trump cards would at times even surprise someone as old and cunning as Little Martin. After these years of training, Lin Dong was clearly no longer the tender young man from Qingyang town. His scheming and mentality had already far exceeded those of his own age. While other young people were acting arrogantly in their youth, this fellow was incredibly cautious and had prepared various trump cards. This was because he clearly understood that he had merely originated from a low-rank empire and he did not possess a strong background. Other than Little Martin, there was no one else he could rely on. Moreover, in Little Martin's case, there were many occasions whereby the latter was unable to unleash his full strength due to his status as a celestial demon Martin. Therefore, Lin Dong could only rely on himself most of the time when faced with a perilous situation. Little Martin smiled gently. This fellow was always able to perform something that an ordinary person could not even imagine. Most importantly, he was able to succeed most of the time. Big Brother Cow, what should we do now? Chang Wei and the rest had a somewhat ugly expression as they watched this scene in the sky. Their hearts were clearly a little uneasy. With the wild violence sweeping across this place, they were unable to even establish the formation. What are you afraid of? I don't believe that with my strength at the peak of the 6 Yuan Nirvana stage and the Heaven Sealing Array, I am unable to finish off even a brat at 4 Yuan Nirvana stage. Cao Yu spoke in a cold and stern voice. Chang Wei and the rest widened their mouths upon hearing this but ceased saying anything else. Cao Yu was right. He was still able to use the strength of the Heaven Sealing Array. That was a genuine pure Yuan treasure. Its strength was sufficient to restrain the heavens and earth. It was likely not impossible to deal with Lin Dong. Rumble. While they were conversing, the thunderbolts in the sky became increasingly wild and violent. Lightning glow lit the entire place. Countless thick thunderbolts were wildly pouring into that enormous black hole. Chi Chi. With an increasing amount of thunderbolt pouring into the black hole, even the surface of the black hole began to vaguely possess layers of lightning arcs. Those lighting glow directly seeped out and headed towards Lin Dong below. Immediately, Lin Dong's sleeves were directly turned into dust. Even his skin revealed a charred black color wherever the lighting glow flowed past. What a wild and violent thunderbolt strength. Lin Dong's eyes became slightly focused as he felt the piercing pain that was transmitted from his hand. This was merely some of the remnant strength that had seeped out from the black hole. He really did not dare to imagine just what kind of scene it would be if the black hole was to burst apart at this moment. It was likely that not even his ashes would be left behind. Clang. Lin Dong exhaled a deep breath of air. He glanced at the storm clouds in the sky that did not show any signs of weakening. His body trembled slightly and numerous green light surged out from within it. After which, layers after layers of green dragon scales began to appear on the surface of his body. Finally, it transformed into a dragon scale armor that protected him within it. Chi Chi. These lightning glows would be reflected upon making contact with the dragon scale. In this way, it greatly reduced the intense pain that he was suffering. The devouring swiftly increased in intensity. This kind of devouring continued for nearly 10 minutes. At the end, the hundred over feet radius around Lin Dong was basically filled by this incomparable wild and violent lightning glow. Even Lin Dong's actual body had an uncontrolled and fierce lightning glow lingering over. Under the erosion of this kind of lightning glow, even the dragon scale, which possessed such a strong defense, was gradually turning charred black. There was vaguely a sign of it cracking apart. Every pair of surrounding eyes could only watch this scene in bewilderment. No one could even block it at all. This was because everyone knew that the surrounding of Lin Dong's body was already permeated with wild and violent thunderbolts. If anyone dared to unleash an attack, those wild and violent thunderbolts would be attracted by that attack. That person would end up attracting the lightning and destroy his own body. Bang! 
another enormous thunderbolt sputtered out from the thundercloud. After which, it was absorbed into the huge black hole. Immediately, there was vaguely some lightning arcs shooting out from which the black hole. From the looks of it, even the black hole formed by the devouring power was somewhat unable to continue devouring. Lin Dong's gently shut eyes also opened at this moment. His eyes looked through the lightning curtain in front of him and saw Kao Yu's gloomy face below. The corner of his mouth slowly lifted into an icy cold smile. After which, he slowly raised his hand and pointed towards Kao Yu in the distance. His hand seal changed in the process. Buzz. The enormous black hole in the sky gradually wiggled as Lin Dong's hand seal changed. The mouth of the black hole was turned downwards. It appeared just like a black cannon mouth that was locked onto Kao Yu from a distance. Creak creak. Lightning glow flickered within the black hole. A kind of annihilation-like fluctuation quietly spread apart. The attack had yet to be unleashed, but the space in front was already distorted. Just when the black hole was locked onto the direction of Kao Yu, Chang Wei and the others behind instantly felt the skin on their heads become numb. A kind of dense feeling of danger rose within his heart. Putting on an act. I want to see just what can you do to me. Kao Yu's expression was dark and solemn. Fury surged within his eyes. After which, both of his hands formed a seal with lightning-like speed. Immediately, the surrounding space began to wiggle wildly. Soon after, numerous shocking black light directly surged out from the space. It became just like numerous large black dragons that intersected in front of him. Heaven sealing array. Black light crisscrossed with each other at a lightning speed. It actually vaguely transformed into a thousand feet large black array. There appeared to be some mountains appearing on the array. A kind of extremely shocking fluctuation spread apart in a partially visible map. The array hung in the sky and appeared incomparably strange. When the array wiggled, it seemed as though the entire place was about to be suppressed by it. The lightning glow within Lin Dong's eyes flickered. There appeared to be some thunderbolt gathering within it. He watched that black colored array that was formed and a wild heat slowly rose on his face. It was the first time that he had controlled such a large and terrifying force. Lin Dong's hand was gently extended out. His finger pressed on the empty space. After which, a soft sound also rumbled and resounded amidst the thunderbolt that permeated through the sky. Go. A word sounded. The entire place appeared to have turned silent instantly. That rapidly rotating black hole suddenly came to a halt. Within the serene darkness, bright sunlight like lightning glow suddenly appeared to be like a volcano that had been pressured for numerous years as it shot out with lightning speed while being accompanied by an earth-shaking momentum. Bang! The entire place trembled. A thousand feet large lightning tore through the sky, appearing to be a real lightning pillar. It displayed a terrifying manner that could destroy everything in its path as it violently struck onto the black array in front of countless pairs of stunned eyes.